Today's episode requires a bit of context. You see, I was playing around on Instagram stories, I was flipping around with the filters, and I found one that I thought was called Cute Nose. I misread the filter name, it was actually called Cute Noise, but I made a joke out of it. I said, perhaps, maybe my nose is cute, maybe I should be a nose model, haha, ha, think nothing more of it. But then I asked myself, at what point does someone become a model? I mean, at what point does an Instagram model become an Instagram model? I'll tell you, when they put it in their bio. So I became a nose model. I set up an OnlyFans, or should I say a nosy fans. And I said that if we amassed a hundred nosy fans, I'd get my nose pierced. And it happened. Everyone's been super supportive because all income from my nosy fans is going to Forever Friends Animal Rescue. And Steph and Phoebe said they wanted to get piercings too, so we decided to film the whole thing. Steph, I'm a fucking idiot. Do you know what I just did? What? I went into the back of someone. Shut up! <laughs> Are you sure you're gonna drive? Because I can drive. Oh my god, you spaz! A lunch Street and a kangaroo hops across oh the road. I've gotten one piercing before and it was my nipple when I went to visit Piper a couple of months ago in Brisbane. You see, I'm trying to get over my fear of needles. So I was having this like conversation with myself like two hours ago. Do I want to oh, have nice. a coffee before this? Because, you know, coffee like gets your heart rate up, whatever, can make you a little bit more anxious. So don't do it. I had a coffee. For fuck's sake, I'm close to you. I'm fucking ready. Fuck. Let's get this ah. Are you sure you're okay to drive? Yeah. <laughs> if you spill my tea, you. Daz, I will. What? Do you know how hot this is? I will, like. And then you will crash crash into a car car. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll drive, I'll drive. Better, better. Hello. Hello. Uh, oh, yes, good day, mate. Guess why Daz is late to my house? Have a little guess. Why? He crashed into the back of someone. He crashed into what? I rear-ended a guy and then I crashed into him. Oh, oh my god, Darren, how bad was it? No, no, no. I don't know. Lit I literally just touched him. Can everyone just chill out? I'm a good driver. Oh, <laughs> Whoa! Fuck! Des! Okay. Are you not feeling safe? Um, can I say no? But that's alright, I've got you. Yeah. What do you do? to calm your nerves? Do you, I, have any, do you have any breathing techniques? I just this my leg, like, like, just like twitch it, like takes me off, like just do that. Yeah. And they go, <laughs> and breathe like heavily. So short, shallow breaths and fast movements yeah. calm you down? Yeah. Come forward, darling. Come through. <laughs> Sorry. One. I'm turning this off. Don't rob me. Hello. Hello. Look at it. Look. Oh my god. <laughs> I only have one. I couldn't find the other ball, so like it just looks really awkward. That looks good though. Phoebe has literally every piercing known to man, so she didn't actually get a piercing with us. She repunctured a hole in her septum, rather. She just did it for shits and gigs before she joined us. Oh, got it. <sighs> Fuck. Do you have piercings today? No, you're not into that, unfortunately. Stacey Wicks Wednesday to Sunday. Oh, that's so, so unlucky. I very wrongly assumed that we wouldn't have any issues getting piercings done on a Tuesday morning in a shopping centre without a booking, but apparently that's like a busy period, so we had to do this all again the next week. <laughs> Fuck it. I should mm. shower and finally. It's well, been you know what? That's why you're late, idiot. It's not okay. And you were gonna you be hit by this. You're idiot way too comfortably. You alright? I'm the hyping myself up. So no miss. Oh, is this. Is this <laughs> should, we, should we hype ourselves up? Alright. What should we do? Listen to the bangers? Yeah, should we do it? Yeah, yeah, let's do it. Right at the front. Bitches. That was actually a really good park. <laughs> Can I just say? That was actually a really good park. I was so surprised how good that was. Thanks, Dirk. Smooth. No, I'm, do I won't leave my. <laughs> hey, Phoebs. Hi. Are you okay, Stas? <laughs> this is the most bizarre thing I've done. I'm like turning myself on. Oh my god. It's <laughs> definitely hard. I'm trying to get it back through. I'm going to go in. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> Just 
just don't look at the fucking needle. Yeah. It's just going to freak you out. Yeah. Just close your eyes, take some deep breaths, and just remember you're paying for someone to stick a needle through you, so it's probably going to hurt. <laughs> Thanks, thanks, baby. <laughs> okay, so here's what happened. Contrary to when I got my nipple done in Brisbane earlier this year, there are so many extra COVID rules here in Melbourne. All of these piercing salons seem to be really strict about having a friend in the room with you. I got this photo moments after it happened with the lady who pierced me, but even that wasn't really allowed. Stus. <laughs> are you okay? I've had better days. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Okay, alright. All right. A few minutes later. Is it bleeding? No, it's no, fine. It looks beautiful. It actually suits you really well. Thank you. How do you feel, Des? I really like it. I actually think it looks really good. Thank you, for me. It suits you. I like yours. I've only got one ball. Got a prostate removed? <laughs> <laughs> Check your balls. What do you have to say to the nosy fans? Because this is what, this is why you got it, hey? Uh, yeah, I mean, so we, we hit 100 nosy fans and I promised to get my nose pierced. I did it. I have no regrets, and thank you to everybody who donated. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Just by the way, for something that started off entirely as a joke, we ended up raising $2,000 for charity. And the day before we hit 100 nosy fans, we made it into the top 6.9% of creators on their platform. What a freaking win. Thank you for being a part of this. How are you feeling? I mean, I've had better days. Yeah. And I feel a bit like fostered, but. All oh, went well, well. You looked a little traumatized, but you seem fine now. Well, I hate needles, so. Do you want to show us? <laughs> <laughs> Did they give you like a thick bar, or was it like one of the thinner gauge? This is too much detail, Darren. No, that's uh, uh, <laughs> Sorry. Why are you asking me these questions? Sorry. Fantastic, this is really good. <laughs> I think I'm overcoming my fear of needles. I'm really. Not. Yes, you are. Uh, hello, did you see me in the room with that? Yeah, that's no. like aftershock. But like, you did it. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what happens when you do it. It's the fact that you did it. Yeah, it might not be pretty. It might not be perfect. But once you do it, it's easy to do it again. Uh, no. Respect. I don't think it becomes easy. It definitely becomes easier. It's like okay. driving, it's hard, it's fucking scary the first couple times when you're on a main road and you got a truck next to you or whatever. You do it again, okay. you do it again, and now I don't care that there's a truck next to me, now I'll flip them off, fuck you truck. <laughs> I run this town, my little yeah, Mazda too. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations, Stussy. I'm proud, proud of us. I'm proud, really of you. proud of you. Give me a hug, I'll be careful. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna show my dad. Nah, fuck that, I won't. Show your dad, yeah, yeah, show your dad. No, I won't. Have well, we're recovering, I hope it's better, yeah? Wait, what? What'd you say? <laughs> recovery. I'm just practicing my nipple right now. I can't speak. You're not really speaking English. Um, uh, that's pretty normal. Hope for you. your recovery is all right. Thank you. You too. Good luck, toodles, bitch. Drive. Bye. Bye. Ah, uh, true. Oh, dude. Oh. Yes, yes, yes. Wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs>